When it comes to junction boxes, more and more electricians are discovering that it's quicker to install a Roxtech multi-cable bonding and grounding transit than to install industry standard connectors for tech cable. We decided to do a time trial. The installation comparison. Roxtech HD32BGB versus connectors for tech cable. Electricians Lauren Riley and Matt Lister of Tarpon Energy Services in Calgary, Alberta, Canada, agreed to perform the installations in front of the camera. Before starting, they made way for 27 cables and a ground wire in the bottom of each stainless steel enclosure, one opening for the Roxtech seal, and 28 half-inch holes for the connectors. It took about one hour to measure and cut out a rectangular hole for Roxtech. It took two hours to measure and map out the right distance between the holes for the connectors and then drill and punch all 28 holes. Here are the parts required for a complete installation. Each connector for tech cable consists of seven components, which makes a total of 196 components for the 28 connectors, in addition to ground lugs, GRLs, for each one. A Roxtech HD32BGB sealing solution consists of a frame with gasket, a counterframe, 16 pieces of 20W40 BGB sealing modules with multi-diameter, including a conductive braid, two compression units, two stay plates, nine bolts, and lubricant. Lauren Riley will perform the installation with connectors for tech cable. Let's see how it goes. The first two connectors take four minutes to install. And the first row of connectors is ready after 13 minutes. The second, third, and fourth rows are completed after one hour, nine minutes, and 24 seconds. Lauren strips the cables to loop each of the ground wires through the GRLs in order to maintain a consistent bond, and then he connects them all to ground via the ground bar at the back of the enclosure. He finishes the installation of the 27 cables and the ground wire in 2 hours, 36 minutes, and 20 seconds. Okay, it's time for Roxtech the challenger when it comes to sealing, bonding, and grounding of all kinds of armored and metal-clad cables. Matt Lister will perform the installation. Now let's see how the Roxtech installation goes. Matt has installed Roxtech BGB solutions before, but not as many times as he's installed connectors for tech cable. He installs the Roxtech HD32 frame in 2 minutes and 25 seconds. Matt peels off layers from the sealing modules to adapt them to the correct cable sizes. He prepares all modules directly so as to be able to route all cables at the same time. This can be done with Roxtech. It's possible to adjust modules later on, while connectors must be fixed right away. After 23 minutes, all cables are prepared. He now fills the opening inserting the first half of the sealing module, followed by the cable, and then the other half of the module. Matt strips the cables, not to loop each of them to another, but to connect them to the ground bar at the back of the enclosure. He finishes the installation of the 27 cables and the ground wire in one hour, 13 minutes and 43 seconds. Counting the time difference for preparing the openings in the enclosures, one hour, and for installing the cables, one hour and 23 minutes, you can save more than two hours work on each enclosure. Well, how about adding a cable in each enclosure? 
Let's just do one more quick time trial. Lauren will add a cable to the stainless steel enclosure using a connector for tech cable. He drills and punches a new half-inch hole, adds the 29th connector and the cable, and starts stripping, looping, and grounding the cable. He finishes the additional installation in 12 minutes and 4 seconds. Matt will add a cable to the stainless steel enclosure with the Roxtech HD32 seal. It has an optional built-in spare capacity for future needs. This means that Matt can open up the seal, remove a spare module, use it to add the new cable, and then reseal it all again. He then strips the cable to connect it to the ground bar at the back. He finishes the additional installation in 6 minutes and 39 seconds.